Casey, a Baron native continuing his journey on NBC's The Voice, did something amazing last night to help lift up the spirits of his hometown. NBC 26's Jennifer Nazza continues our team coverage now. Jennifer. Regina, Chris Cruzy was back on The Voice last night for Dedication Week. He chose to sing Let It Be, what he calls a song of hope. The song Chris Cruzy sang last night on The Voice was dedicated to his small hometown of Barron. It's the same song he sang at a vigil for 13-year-old Jamie Kloss just a few weeks ago. His hometown is hurting as the worst has happened to them. A mother and father were murdered and their daughter, Jamie, is still missing. Chris is now on the national stage, but rather than focusing on himself, he has one focus, to lift up his community during this painful time. I'm wearing a green ribbon on my guitar strap that represents hope. Barron has always been there for me, and I've got an opportunity to be there for them. And the support Cruzy is giving to his community is also being received. Last night, Cruzy's family and friends attended a watch party in Barron. His parents said they're nervous for tonight's elimination episode. It's up to America, so I mean, you know, I'll, I'll sleep and dream about it. Cruzy is fighting for a spot in the top 11 close this morning, but you can tune into The Voice tonight to see if he makes it through to the next round. Keeping you connected, Jennifer Nazza, NBC 26. Thanks, Jennifer, and you'll be able to see Cruzy tonight on The Voice. That's at 7 o'clock p.m. right here on NBC 26. And also just a reminder, there is still a tip line for any information on Jamie Kloss. That number again, 1-855-744-3879.